edebilirdin. Kurtarmayabilirdin. Beni sırtında taşıdın, ameliyat ettin. Pardon. Sen çok iyi birisin. Kurtarmak için yapmadın. Danını rahatlatmak için yaptın. Asli is so sad to hear this from him. She realizes that she did all this because she loves this man. She gets so upset when she sees him hurt and even has nightmares that he will die. But Farah can't even understand her. After returning home, Farhat learns from his uncle that all this is the work of his enemies. The next day, when Farhat tries to take revenge on his enemies, Asli stops him. She makes it clear that what everyone wants now is not revenge. Since his sister-in-law and nephew are here now, they need companionship and comfort. She requests him not to run away from his feelings anymore. Asli says this because she wants Farhat not to be blinded by hatred all the time and wants him to learn to love his family. Farhat couldn't resist Asli and was convinced. When he goes to visit his nephew, who has a fever, his nephew asks him to tell him a story. This makes Farhat's mind go completely blank. How could he know how to tell stories to little kid? Is he supposed to tell a story about a gunfight?